Hi guys, Kevin Kistein here, standing in front of our 2013 Ford F-150. Super, super nice truck. It is a Lariat with the EcoBoost. Uh, it does have running boards. Uh, nice decals on the sides. Some nice steps there to get you into the back of the truck. Full-size spare underneath. Tonneau, tuxedo tonneau cover up top. It does have a backup camera. Uh, your full towing set up right there for you as well. It is pre-wired as well. And open the back here and show you that it also has a drop-in bed liner right there with your weather sealed tonneau up top. Walk around the sides here. I'm looking for any type of rust or anything that would detour myself from purchasing a pickup. Uh, nice like I said, those chrome running boards might be my favorite part of the truck. Uh, nice, good tread depth here on your tires left. You should get another year or half or so out of those tires. Iconic oval, blue oval up front. Everybody knows that's a, that's a Ford coming down the road. Again, this is a Lariat F-150 2013. Uh, I'm going to hop in the truck with you. I'm actually going to open the door here and show you. I noticed this. It looks like it's uh, the paint's gone there it looks like it's scratched off probably getting in and out with work boots i'm gonna guess or something along those lines full leather in the back seat as well so when you take a step back off the truck here a little bit you can see and i just noticed something here too it looks like it's beginning to rust right there in the back corner of this bed here so right here there is some rust starting to develop i'm gonna go i'm gonna actually I just noticed that, so I'm going to walk around and check the other side of the truck as well, okay? Let's do this together. If you're spending thousands of dollars with me, I want to make sure that you're 100% satisfied. So let's take a peek at this side as well. Yep, same thing. So there is some rust beginning to develop right back here in this corner again. And it's surface rust, so it could probably could probably be repaired at this point. Um, I will uh, hop in the car. I'm going to start it for you. Again, straight body lines. Other than the rust in those two corners, pretty sharp little truck. 82,000. I apologize. There it is. I'll focus it in there for you. 82,209 miles. I'm going to start this truck for you. Grab the key right here. And it does have the remote start. As you can see, no check engine lights on or anything like that. Uh, I am showing a low tire light, but that's okay. I actually know exactly what tire that is. I apologize for that. We can scroll through this together. Oh, wow, gosh. Sorry, let me get that. There we go. Fuel economy. You can check that. Um, that's cool. 207 miles till empty. Settings. We can scroll through all this. Super nice truck. I apologize. It's, it's coming in out of focus. So here's your backup camera. I'm going to put my foot on the brake. Put the vehicle in reverse. It's turning on to sync. There's your backup camera there. And it's beeping because the sensor's on. So I'm just going to turn that off real quick. Silence the bump, the beeping. So that actually made it really simple to back the vehicle in. The other really cool feature is if I hold this down, it'll fold in your mirrors. And these are heated outside mirrors. Um, the really nice thing about that is if you have to park this vehicle in a garage, or a tight parking spot at work. You don't have to worry about your neighbors or uh, somebody hitting the vehicle and, and busting off a mirror. All right, so there you have it, guys. This is our 2013 Ford F-150 Lariat. Uh, if you have any questions, give me a shout. Thanks a lot, have a great day.